Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. Let's continue where we left. Previous lesson we finished our one of controllers which is called home page. Now we carry on the next one. Let me have a look quickly. Portfolio. Let me have a look at our portfolio. Oh sorry. I need to go to to view model. Yeah. Hmm. Title, file name, file sub category of ID. So I am going going to have a picture and title. Perfect. And we have a category. All right. Okay. Okay. Let's continue with the controller. Where is controller area admin controller? Portfolio controllers. Private read only. I portfolio service. Let's create constructors. Okay, okay. So, uh, I'm just thinking, how should I do? It's a lot of pictures, right? So normally we're using tables, but in these circumstances, I guess we should use cards. Yeah, perfect. Okay, let's finish our codes first, then we can design our browser pages. Close that one. Copy from let's copy from here. Oh, here, yeah, very nice. Let's copy the codes. Perfect. First, change the services. Then change the names. Portfolio. Portfolio list. Portfolio add portfolio. What's what's the matter? Let's make control Z. Get oh, what is this? Portfolio. I'm just copying just a text. Yeah, get portfolio list. Portfolio list. Get all this portfolio. Okay, perfect. Amend it. Portfolio again. Portfolio at portfolio async get portfolio list. Let's fix the update method now. Portfolio view portfolio. Update portfolio, portfolio update. Yep, change the redirection. Perfect. Last method is the delete and after that we continue with the browser pages. Portfolio and portfolio. Perfect. So finish. Control R G. Now create portfolio list. Add view. Browser page. Add. And layout is correct. Okay. We can edit. Hmm. 
<clears throat> Maybe I can use normal table list and when I update the click update I can see the picture over there. Yeah, I can I can do something like it. Yeah, let's let's do again a table at model list portfolio list view model control x even ports okay okay not the controller uh, which one is much better for me add category uh, sorry category list portfolio list done all right dashboard done portfolios it's plural yep one two one two three um, category yeah one two three four four is enough I guess four is enough yeah um, name is okay uh, what was the second one what was the second one name portfolio right hmm. category we need category yeah category create and update it edit and delete yeah this is the title this is the category dot name updated date and create date actually created it first update date next all right let's type here portfolio data id and rules all done edit delete yeah all good portfolio add portfolio add portfolio yes very nice guys is there any missing or wrong place i'm just checking quickly all right careful let's have a look at our portfolio list what are we going to have what's the problem Mapping portfolio list portfolio list let me have a look portfolio list view model let's have a look at our mappers portfolio yeah portfolio and home page is done so that's the problem probably we were doing copy paste again Now it should be done. As we are waiting to page to be opened. Yes, test pictures all here. All I wanted when I clicked add, I'm going to see the form with the picture. I mean edit. Yeah. All right. Okay. 
product controllers add portfolio add view it's gonna be a razor view and layout is done name is done let's continue with that button All right, add model, the name was of portfolio add view model, perfect. Not that one, contact, add contact, yeah. We just need to copy and paste and amend it, that's all. Add portfolio. A new portfolio. Let's copy the portfolio because we need it. Get portfolio list portfolio. Perfect, hold on. change those all of them and of course we need to we need to activate our multi-part I mean from data because we need to send pictures all right um, Title Let's type headers Cold email Previous one we forget to call text area Okay maybe we can fix it later doesn't matter too much doesn't affect our project for now we add title file name is going to be other side quit and update date and category oops sorry guys quit and update date Yeah, automatically this is list by the way why I'm looking the listing view model uh, view model portfolio add all right we define name and time and cat category yes no, no, portfolio Add portfolio set. yeah perfect title and category dot name okay okay next one file name and type we're going to make hidden for now category done Let's copy from the others. Not that, not that one. Where is the view? No, we don't need. We need. We need them. For a part, so I, that's why we couldn't find it. Okay, perfect. File name, file name and type done, title done, category okay, let's delete the rest of them. 
boom, boom, boom. So where is going to be the picture? All right. Um, uh, I'm gonna add a image source, which is going to be a card. So I'm gonna edit this file name. All right. Let's have a look or. Win browser. Let's have a look to the cards. Oh, which one is good for us? What about this one? Uh, I'm gonna use this one. Cut the image on top. Yeah, I'm just going to use the t um, title. Yeah, I think it's good. It's in cards, right? Let's open cards. Yeah, here. Let's copy this card. And to the Add Portfolio. Let's just use a temporary picture from our Asset. I'm not going to use that one. Let's actually, it must be in the update, not the add, because we still don't have any picture. So I want to add where is it about. Yeah, add contact. No, don't do contact. Where is the portfolio? Controllers, add portfolio. Yeah. Now I am going to add this. I'm sorry, wrong place. I'm going to add this photo here. And of course, we need to add our about add remodel yeah form file so we need it at portfolio add and portfolio update perfect hold on so all right portfolio list portfolio yeah compiler is done okay portfolio portfolio post multi-part hidden is hidden are okay title category name and photo all done it must be work right now let's have a jump to update method Yes, they are update. Continue to adding our pages. Yes, immediately let's make a control B. Uh, all right, no problem. We're going to find out again. Let's copy from here first. Sorry, not that one. Portfolio remodel controller with portfolio list 
add portfolio. Yeah, this is what I need. Let's control C and delete that one. Update, not that one. Let's close this. Portfolio. Update portfolio, yes. Add model portfolio update view model. Let's have a look quickly. This is going to be between these two. Mm. Yep, yep. Card title. Add model dot title. Card uh, right by the card type. Yes. Make it update portfolio admin update update okay they're going to be coming automatically we can use where is the div yeah we can use it we can use it for the change our pictures and picture is going to be shown upper side and any 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 that we forget let's have a little list model again let's be model yeah let's have a look quickly let's click edit yeah we don't have any picture right now so that's look like this but actually we we did have yeah yeah we need admin now it's all right i guess let me have a look admin yeah hot reload yeah this is the picture and this is the information and we're going to keep the pictures small okay how can we do? Let's add a style. Um, width and for example, use px. What's gonna happen if I just put a bit? Let's weave in browser. Edit. Yeah, it's come it's become smaller automatically. But I'm not gonna use that one. Make it control set. I want it bigger. It doesn't matter. No problem at all. Keep it like that. Okay, all right. Um, let's test all of them now. Add another picture, delete and update it. Add portfolio header. Test. Test. Voice. We need to change the name, it's called <laughs> Choose file is coming automatically for now. Submit. Okay. Add. Edit. Mm, we need to change those names. Okay, alright. Update, update portfolio. Very nice. Let's change the background. Update portfolio. Update. Let's 
let's make edit again. There is two header here. Actually, we don't need a header. Let's kill it down. We'll clear than that one. These two and these two. We don't need it. What's gonna happen if I delete it? Let's have a look. We have a card by delete the card by the I think it will be interesting. Okay, let's click edit. Uh, I don't need it. It's alright. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, it's working. Again, we win browser. Let's try the update method now. Where is the problem? Concurrency. Yep. Update. ID and row version. Let's add those two. Try again. We're going to change later to change all logic codes because we're going to add pictures. Yeah, it's working. All right, let's delete it. Delete is working. Okay, perfect. Let's save them all. Minimize. Close all tabs. All right, guys. Let's finish this lesson here. And we can continue with the other controller for the next lesson. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.